What's up? Welcome back, Enchanters, to another segment of a complete collection. Now, this collection is not one that has been mentioned, but something very special happened this week, and, well, it actually happened almost a month ago. I received this, and I've been dying to share it, but with so much new receipts coming in and pre-requested videos, I, I had to do this. I had to do this, and also give the the vendor who created these a shout out. So um, once again, if you're watching me for the first time, hi, I'm Jean-Pierre, Bon Jovi, pleasure. Uh, it's a pleasure to have you here. What you can expect on my channel is every Monday, I religiously post content of collectible figurines, not only Disney, but other uh, figurines and collectibles that I do collect. Aside from that, um, we do do some unpackings and some additional videos on Thursdays as well. And this video <laughs> it releases will be released on a Thursday, which is exciting. Aside from that, um, because it's a shorter video. Aside from that, it, it's a, just an absolute pleasure to have you here. And it means the world when you subscribe. So um, right below, click that bell subscribe to get notified um hit the bell to be notified every time i come to you with content on mondays and thursdays i post every monday and on some thursdays and um it means the world and you can follow me on instagram for other photos i'll be posting and i get to like start getting more engaged with instagram i know but you'll be seeing more content from me on instagram as well I do sell some pieces, and you can contact me on Instagram as well if you're interested in any of the pieces. Whenever I am selling, I am not selling any of these. These are all part of my personal collection. And uh, we are having a giveaway. So let's go ahead and check out that video. Uh, uh, it's a giveaway that we're having to get to 1,000 subscribers. So let's go check it out. And don't forget about our incredible giveaway that we're having. This is for reaching 1,000 subscribers. The moment we get to 1,000 subscribers, we will be doing this incredible giveaway, which is the 100 Acre Caper Adventure Winnie the Pooh piece. Um, in order to be eligible to earn this giveaway, you must be subscribed to our channel. You must like our videos and every video that you comment under and that you share, you get multiple entries. So if you share our video, you get two entries. And for every time that you comment on any of my videos, um, uh, beginning from the months of July through, um, through once we get to the thousand subscribers, my goal is to get to a thousand by the conclusion of August. Fingers crossed with your support, we'll get there you will be receiving an entry. So you get two entries for sharing the video, share it on any of your platforms, Facebook, uh, Twitter, any anywhere on social media, uh, Instagram. And if every time you comment on any of our videos and you engage with me, you also get an entry. So this is a beautiful, beautiful piece. As you zoom in, it's one of my favorite Winnie the, Winnie the Pooh Jim Short pieces ever made. It's this beautiful tree bark, Winnie reaching inside the tree to gather some honey. There's the little details with the bees and then you have his best friends, Tigger, Piglet, and Eeyore, all supporting him on this venture. It is absolutely adorable, and I can't wait for someone to earn this. So may the odds forever be in your favor, and let's get back to our video. All right, so without further ado, let's get started. So what do we have here? Because I didn't mention in the beginning of the video. So what we have here is the complete collection of the Disney Marionette collection from Disney Jim Shore. This collection came out around 2013, 2014. And it was a Steamboat, Mickey, a Steamboat Willie, a Mickey, Goofy, Minnie, and Donald piece that launched. And a Tinkerbell. And when you purchased them, there were six pieces. They came in these little beautiful see-through boxes, which is never done before, right? And you can see the, the marionette piece inside the box. And aside from that, they sold this single marionette stand. So this stand right here is for you to pose very, you know, to pose them each on. Now, I wanted to speak into the stand itself. So this stand itself has gone up drastically on the secondary market. It goes for like 150, 185. And what happens is a lot of the collectors bought six stands, which, you know, I only purchased one. I didn't, I thought that was so unnecessary because each stand was like 50, 55, 60 dollars uh, MSRP. So that would make these pieces very expensive. And so my intention was only ever to like put one on them and keep the others in their box until, um, and I don't have any of his information on, so I'm gonna go ahead and tag all of that in the description. 
I came across a group, uh, Disney Avengers. There was a seller in the UK who creates these 3D printed stands and he customizes them. And they were all in copper or like gold or silver. And then he had colored ones. So I was like, you have colored ones? So I bought the colored ones. We're gonna dive into that in a moment because it's so much more cheaper. I believe they're like, you can't quote me here. I could be wrong. I believe they were like $15 each. I'm not sure. You, can, you can't quote me on it. All the details on his Facebook, how to order will all be linked below. He also sells them on eBay, but if you're in the States, it's much cheaper to order them um, through um, Facebook with him and just pay through PayPal goods and services. I got my shipment in less than two weeks from ordering it. It was amazing. It was a smooth process. So before we continue with that, let's talk about the original base. This is the original base. Let's talk about Tinkerbell. So as you can see, I left her on the original base. And I absolutely love this. It's like a it's like a showcase scene as you zoom in on the details. You have Tinkerbell and it's all posable. So everything is posable. Her legs, everything. It's a marionette. These pieces are very delicate. You don't want to bang them or move them or play with them. You don't want to do that. And so as you can see, it hooks right onto the base. And there you have it. I don't, I just display them. I never play with them as an actual marionette. And um, the first marionette piece he ever made was a Pinocchio piece, which we haven't done a Pinocchio video. So we definitely have to do that sometime soon. But this one um, right here, these then followed and these were the remaining marionette pieces. And after these pieces, he never made any others. These pieces easily damage, easily, easily, easily. So they're very fragile. And it's just the concept that is, um, it's, it's very difficult to actually fulfill. And because of that mixed media details, I don't think we're ever gonna see future marionette pieces. But this is it right here. This is the Tinkerbell. And they each retailed, I believe, for like 50, $55 when they launched. So this is the original one. And so being that I didn't have an opportunity to display the rest of my pieces, I said to myself, well, I guess I'm just going to leave them in their boxes. And that like, you know, but which, what was great about it is that the box has like this plastic see-through film. So you were able to see the piece, but it wasn't too clear. And then we have this amazing inventor of these stands. So he um, created these. And what I love about these is I'm actually going to remove our lazy Susan. And I'm actually going to have y'all focus in on all of the pieces. What's great about these is you can pick different colors. They, by the way, all have the Mickey. So they all have the Mickey logo. And that was convenient for the Mickey and Friends, not for Tinkerbell. That's why I kept Tinkerbell like that. And I could have gotten a green neon base for her, but I was like, no, no. That's why we have this, Dan. And what's really awesome about all of these which I love so, 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 so much, is that they're also customizable. He can create and put the name on. So if you notice, each stand, one says Mickey, Goofy, Steamboat, Willie, Minnie, and Donald. And I got them based, I color coordinated them based on the color of them. So orange for Goofy, red for Mickey, that baby blue for Minnie, and yellow for Donald. So, um... He had a, an arrangement, uh, an array of colors, and again, you can have it customized or you cannot have it customized with the name. And I had him put the names on them because I think it gives it so much more dimension. <laughs> They're so amazing. Um, after like shipping and everything, each one was like less than $25. And again, it's shipping from the UK, so it's going to be a little bit more pricier. But he was able to, I saved $35 when I placed the order through him directly versus ordering it through his eBay link. And I'll put his eBay link down there as well. Um, they are absolutely adorable. So let's go ahead and get started with the first one. Let's do it. Let's start with Steamboat Willie because Steamboat Willie, when I did my vintage collection, can you believe I forgot to include this piece in the vintage collection? I know. And I also forgot to include the vintage Mickey from the holiday. There's a holiday gift set with uh, five Mickeys throughout the years. I forgot to include that one too. I always do it with that set. Always. So I wanted to start off with this one. And I picked this like a uh, gray, um, like this gray colored um, stand for him because it's, I think it's just ideal versus I could have gotten with a black or a white, but I thought this would be ideal. It's a steamboat wheelie on the bottom. And this is it as you zoom in on all the details. It is absolutely gorgeous. It is like a, it's a, it's a 3D printed uh, stand. It's made of plastic, but it is done beautifully. And what's so great about this, it's so much more secure than that because this slides out. It's made so perfectly. Look at the construction on this. It has a slot 
and you insert it and it clicks into place. I mean, brilliant. Again, these were custom made. I thought this was so ideal. What's also awesome is that if you follow him on Facebook and his group, I'm going to pin that as well. Um, you can PM him if you have a certain collectible or uh, a certain figurine that you collect, but you know, it's really difficult. He takes suggestions and he can develop and create something for your figurine. Now he'll only do it. I believe if it's something that is something that's highly in demand and sought after, like, uh, maybe there's a collectible piece in our collection. I can't think of anything maybe aside from an ornament stand, but you can easily find those on Amazon cheaper than if you were to buy something like, you know, and I don't think it's worth it for him to make something like that. But if you had something that you wanted to create, like something to sustain or stand, he can do that with a lot of feedback. He can. Maybe you're, you collect other figurines, other stuff. He can create 3D models for, for them as well, which I thought was pretty awesome. So go check his Facebook group out. And again, I'll link that all in the description. So this is Steamboat, Mickey, Willie. Followed by that, we have Minnie. She is so freaking cute. Look at that. And it says Minnie on the bottom. Uh, I think I'm the only one that ordered these, and I could be wrong, that ordered these in actual colors. So I'm so excited to post a picture of these on my on Disney Avengers. Disney Avengers was the group that inspired me. And he's also on Disney Collectible Fans, which I mentioned on my previous video. The seller posted there. But where I first saw it was Disney Avengers. And I was like, I have to have this. The admins vouched for him. And again, he was super awesome. He, I believe he recognized me from my channel as well. So I told them I'd give him a shout out. Following that, we have the Mickey piece. Hey, Mickey. <laughs> so we have Mickey. He was so cute. Again, I just love, I'm so glad I got them in different colors. And I was conflicted. I didn't know to get lime green for Goofy or to get orange, but I ended up going with the orange because the orange is more pronounced here and the green is very subtle on the top of his head. And I am so glad I did because I love this orange color. And Goofy's the only one that he's a little taller than the stand because of his legs, but they rest just perfectly there and he still wobbles and moves around, which is perfect. So freaking cute. And last but certainly not least, my favorite Mickey and Friends character, Donald. I freaking love Donald. Uh, when it comes to like my three favorite Disney characters, it's Dopey, followed by Abu, followed by Donald. Um, those are my three all-time favorite characters. And this piece is just absolutely, look at this piece. It's gorgeous. I love him. He like dangles, I think, the most. <laughs> He's so freaking cute. His color story is amazing. And this yellow background really makes him pop so much more. I'm glad I got this yellow versus like that cobalt blue. And these are all of the pieces. I really hope that if you are a marionette collector and you have these and or if you have other marionette pieces that are the same configuration, same size, he can create a stand for you, even if it's not something Disney related. You can ask him. I can't guarantee anything, but I thought this was so conventional and so smart and ingenious um, because this piece right here, this stand alone is like 150 185 right now in the secondary market. That's just way too, it's more expensive than the actual pieces themselves. And so this is just such a smarter choice. Um, it supports also another small business and I thought this was so freaking genius. So I hope this video inspired you. And if you place an order with him, comment below and let me know that you placed an order with him. Um, I think that'd be amazing. I'd like to like give him feedback and let him know, hey, I had like X amount of commenters say that they want to order this because they saw this video. I think that would be great. So thank you so much for this quick, brief, adorbs video. Um, I have two more videos to film today. <laughs> I am on a roll. And so thank you for your time and I cannot wait to see you on our next video. Stay amazing, everyone. Bye.